Microsoft warrants about recall, ignoring the list of websites it should not screenshot. After months of delays, recall is finally available for public testing in the Windows Insider program. Microsoft listened to critiques and feedback after the early misfired launch and went the extra mile to ensure the safety of your data. However, if you plan to test the current version of Recall, beware of a no issue due to which, in certain scenarios, Recall ignores the list of websites it should not capture. In the release notes for just uh, released Windows 11 Depot Build 26120.2415, Microsoft stated that Recall may still take snapshots or screenshots or of filter out the website if they are up they are open in Microsoft Edge split screen or the sidebar. Websites added as filters may be saved in the content is in a split screen or sidebar pane in Edge. This will be addressed in an update. Microsoft said multiple times that recall snapshots are stored locally and never leave your device. Turning off recall deletes all your snapshots with no way to recover them. They are also fully encrypted and inaccessible until you authenticate with Windows Hello. However, Microsoft understands that not everyone is comfortable with allowing Windows 11 to take a screenshot of literally everything that is not the screen, even if those screenshots do not go anywhere, hence the ability to include certain apps and websites. If you are one such user but, but the temptation to try recall is too high, maybe it is better to wait for a few updates before pulling the trigger. Microsoft says that the bug will be fixed in the future update. There are other no bugs, but this one is the most important. Alternatively, do not open stuff you do not want to have saved in split view or sidebar. Recall is currently available only to Windows Insiders in the depth channel on Copilot Plus PCs with Snapdragon X processors, AMD and Intel powered Copilot Plus PCs with the newest processors and NPUs will get Recall a bit later.